Good afternoon, everyone. How the fuck are you guys? Um, I'm doing pretty good. I want to do a, a quick video reply to some comments that I got in my video. Um, what, what the hell was it? Put my money where your faith is. A, a video I'll link over there. Most of you have already watched it. Um, the comments I, I got um, from a woman who goes by the name The Repentant Mouth. And what I find really interesting about the comments that you sent me, talking directly to you, Repentant Mouth, is that you did something really, really sort of underhanded, and I think you know you did. Um, now, logical people, rational, intelligent, logical people, watched that video over there, and, and they thought, uh, uh, quite a few things, you know, first thing they thought was, uh, wow, he's, he, he's really pissed off in this video, and, and another thing they probably thought was, he, he's really mad that people are saying prayer is more powerful than, than medication, and that people need prayer instead of medicine, he, he's really pissed off about that, because a lot of the comments that I got reflected, um, that attitude, that people understood what I was getting at. Now, I got a few comments from Christians or theists, whatever, and um, none of them really took, took me up on the challenge, and, and I didn't think that anyone would, but, but apparently um, you're, you, the repentant mouth, you came closer than anyone else. You know, I did a video a couple days ago where, where I sort of covered this. But what really upsets me about you people who say that prayer is powerful is that I do not believe at all that you believe in the product that you're selling to other people. And that's what makes me angry, right? It's the fact that, that not, not even you believe your own bullshit and even and, and you're still even knowing that you don't believe it you're still willing to sell the product to other people you're you're still willing to spread the bullshit around um you you said you made a couple statements in my comment section the first being quote i could have the best doctors in the world but if God wants me, it won't make a bit of difference how great the doctors are, right? End quote. Um, what I said in, in my original video, um, wrong. That statement is false, and you don't believe it. Um, you don't believe it at all. Because you, you took advantage of my anger in that video and I, I did I did say something in the video that I regret you're right I said some bad things in the video and or I think what I really did was I, I left some things out because I was pissed off when I made the video that I should have included like um, only a serious offer will apply only a serious person who really wants to take the challenge you know I, I'm obviously not a millionaire so any, any person could come along and say, all right, Sarah, honey, give me $30 million, and I'll take your challenge. And, and everybody knows. I mean, come on. If you have any, you know, fucking brain power at all, you, you could draw the conclusion that I'm not a fucking multimillionaire and that I can't afford to pay somebody's medical bills for the rest of their life, really. And that's even if they didn't allow me to do it. What, what's amazing, though, is, is that, while you told me in your comments not to hate you because you don't hate me, I don't like you because what you did was is you blatantly took advantage of the way I communicated my challenge in that video just to fuck with me. You don't, you don't take this prayer challenge thing seriously. Um, if you did, you would say something like, do what you can to help your friend. Give what you can, and I'll sign your contract. Um, but the problem here is that none of you have any confidence 
in, in the prayer that you tell other people to have confidence and faith in. None of you have it. Um, yeah, I, I was pissed off. I, I should I should not have said um, uh, or implied in the video that I could pay any fucking dollar amount because everybody knows or anybody should assume that I can't. But what's really amazing is the only person who tried to bounce back that challenge didn't take it seriously at all. None of you believe in this product that you're selling. Not one of you. Um, also, you said in, in your comments, uh, quote, I've seen a lot of people healed by prayer, haven't you? No, I, I've never in my life, not once ever, seen anyone healed by prayer. Ever. Never. Not once. Um, so if you really, if any of you out there watching this video really believe prayer to be as powerful as you say you believe it is, just prove it. That's my challenge. I can't afford to pay you 40 million fucking dollars. But I can afford to call you a liar. And I can afford to say that you're being deceptive. And I can afford to say that you're full of shit when you tell other people how powerful you believe prayer to be. Because you don't. So, without being too mean, because you're a girl, I, I thought that was a really strange comment to leave, like, you're a lady, so you think I should take it easy on you or something. Uh, without being too mean or hateful, prove to me that you believe in prayer as much as you say you do, or just fuck off, because I'm not interested. Prove it, or get the fuck out. That's all. Peace.